Hey, welcome to the Learning Fun Show. <laughs> Today in our class, we are going to do a survey. And with that information, we're going to make a picture graph. All right, let's get started here. Um, once again, what you are going to need is your math notebook or a piece of paper. And um, we're going to do this exercise and let's just, let's just work on it together. So let's go ahead here. Um, a survey. A survey is I'm going to ask a question and then I hope to go get some results. For instance, if I were to say to my class, what is your favorite color? I'm going to ask that question and then each person might have a different color and then I would write that information down. My question is, who is in my class? Now my class is a bunch of animals and now when I mean a bunch of animals is there are actually animals in my classroom and I want to find out who is in my classroom. All right. So I have a feeling it's there's cows in my classroom. Yeah, yeah, I hear you guys. And the monkeys over there and the horses. Horses, get off the shelf. I didn't put the apples up there. Come on, guys. You're going to get yourself hurt. So I need to find out how many cows and monkeys and horses are here because I want to have a little party after school and get some cookies. And uh, yes, I know you want some banana cookies. <laughs> Apple cookies. All right, guys. And you guys want some milk? All right, chocolate milk for you. All right, the cows want milk. Anyway, um, usually they drink fruit juice around here. So right away, I need to get some information, don't I? So let's um, go ahead and ask who's in my classroom. And when you hear a cow or a monkey or a horse, I want you to go ahead and put a tally mark in your results. Now remember, with tally marks, and we'll get to that, um, if you have a group of five, you, you kind of do that little slash there thing, and we'll get to that. All right, so first of all, um, let's get some results. Who is in my class? Can, can you start over there? Oh, monkey, all right, we got one for monkey. Okay, and, oh, all right, we got another one for cow over there. All right, and so, yeah, monkey, get off the light there, come on. They're always goofing around, get another vote for a monkey, yeah. Horse, get, can you sit down in your chair, horse. You're going to get in, hurt there. All right, we've got one here. All right, another one for cow. All right, oh, another one for monkey. Monkey, I said no chewing gum in classroom. It's going to get in, see what happened? It got in your fur. It's, it's going to take an hour to get that out with the scissors again. Oh, we've got another cow. All right, all right. Another horse over there. Quit horsing around, will you? Come on. Hey, another one for monkey. Okay. And it, who is under the sink? Will you, you do need to be sitting down. Another monkey right there, I'll tell you. Um, now look at right here. I got another monkey. I have four monkeys right here. I, I did four tally marks. One, two, three, four. Now I need to do one more tally mark, and that is a group of five. All right, that's it for right now. Um, this is all I have in my classroom. Um, the alligator, uh, we had some complaints, so the alligator had to go next door to the other second grade class. This is our information, all right? Now, so what I like to do is I like to have a little column over here. We'll put a little column right there. And I like to add up my tally marks. Can you add them up with me? Let's start counting. One, two, three. Uno, dos, tres. All right. Look at that. Look how easy it is to count this. I don't need to go one, two, three, four, five. No, you see a group like that. Super easy, cheesy, lem squeezy. That's five right there. Uno, dos, one, two. All right. Put the two right there. Now, this is the fun thing right here. We get to do a picture graph. Now, later on, you're going to be doing some bar graphs, but I decided we're going to do a picture graph. What is a graph? A graph is a visual picture of your information, all right, of your data. So how many cows do we have? We had three cows, all right. Now, if you wanted to, you could draw faces of cows in there. It's up to you, whatever you want to do. Um, I'm just going to draw some circles right here. One, two, three, all right. Monkeys, okay. The, no, I'm... 
What? Are you st they want me to draw bananas for them. So how many bananas do I have to draw? Five of them. The bananas representing a... Uh, I know it doesn't look like a banana. I don't know how to draw a banana, all right? All right. Um, I have to draw five of those. All right. Um, horses. Are you serious? You want me to draw an apple now? Because the bananas... With the, all right, they want me to draw some apples. How many apples do I need to draw? Two. The apples represent the horses. All right. I don't know. They, they keep me busy all the time. Now, here is our picture graph, a visual representation of our data. Very easy to see this information, isn't it? So what animal is the most in my class? What animal do I have the most of? That's right, monkeys. It's easy to see that, isn't it? What is the least amount of, uh, of a particular type of animal? <laughs> the horse. Again. I know your sister is sick. She'll be coming next week. Okay, don't worry about it. Cows. How many do we have of cows? Three. All right. Um, how many horses and cows do I have all together? Three plus two equals five. So if we did a, a soccer game later on today, we'll have a soccer game, okay? We will have the cows and the horses on one side and then the monkeys on the other side. So that will be five with the horses and the cows. And then the monkeys, you got five there, five together. Okay. So I, don't worry. I know you didn't bring your gym shoes, okay? Whew. I tell you, they keep me busy all the time. So what did we do today? We took a survey. A survey is a question. With that question, we went out and got some data. We took our data and we put it down like tally marks. We added our data up. Then we made a picture graph, picture graph, vis visual representation of our data. And now we know um, that we can have the two sides on a soccer team and how many cookies I need to get. So how many cookies do I need to get? Five plus three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10 cookies. Well, maybe 11, because I, I think I might want a cookie myself. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show today. Make sure you check out my other videos on here. I got some cool drawing videos and more daily math practice all the time. Have a fun day. Adios.